if you ever had that feeling in your gut that something was off when you was communicating or texting a woman, there's a 99% chance that that's true. Okay, never ignore that little person on your shoulder that's tapping you, that's telling you, you should probably cut contact with this chick. So I came up with 10 signs a woman is not actually interested in you over text. Your time is very valuable. Don't allow a woman to waste it. The first sign a woman is not actually interested in you over text message is let's say you guys have been communicating throughout the day consistently. What will happen is at about 7 or 8 p.m., she'll completely go ghost and cut contact. And what will happen is she'll text you the next day and say, oh, I fell asleep or I'm just now seeing this or I was busy. Sorry, she wasn't busy. What was happening is, and I've been on both sides of the coin, is one, she doesn't see you as a priority. And two, around that time, she's getting her back blown out. She's sleeping with a guy. She's hooking up with a guy. Okay, I've been there where a woman will text all her basic beta male orbiters, the guys who want to sleep with her around that time and she'll stop. It's because she just kind of wants to string you along and keep you at bay and keep receiving your attention while she's actually having physical sexual contact with the guy she really wants. So she'll hit you up the next day, act like she was busy with a project or she was helping a family friend doing something. She, she wasn't, trust me. She just doesn't see you as a priority. Cut her off, move forward. Or what you need to do is say, hey, let's get together and hang out and be direct. Number two, if a woman never initiates contact and never hits you up first, and you're always the one to reach out, she's not actually interested. I'll give you another example. Let's say you're hanging out and hooking up with a woman consistently. You guys are having sex one or two times a week, but she never initiates contact to see you again and you're always texting her, hey, when are you free? Let's hang out. This is a sign that she's not truly interested in you. Now, you can keep hanging out with that chick, but just know that she's going to look for you to initiate contact. So what you need to do is pull back and not say anything. It might be a week or two weeks, but you need to let her know, hey, listen, you need to start initiating contact with me and texting me first. If you're always the one texting her throughout the day first, initiating, good morning, doing all these different things, she never hits you first. And women love to text and, and talk. She's not truly 100% interest, interested. She might be like 50%, you know, medium interest, but it's not really that high. In order to get a woman to text you first and initiate contact, she has to see you as high, high value, right? She has to be 100% all in on you and interested. In order to do that, you have to bag away and don't say anything to let her know, hey, you got to put in some sort of effort. I can't just be reaching out all the time. Number three, if she ever texts you with an LOL or she might say silly during a text message or she says ha ha or she might use a lot of laughing face emojis, it's because she doesn't really see you as someone she's actually interested in. She see you as a joke. You're just a game, somebody to pass time with. OK, if you start to see all this goofy text message like you're some just guy to just joke around with. Just cut her off because she's not truly into you, okay? Women do this to dudes just to have a good time. She probably sees you as more of a friend and not like a, a guy she wants to be with and be intimate with sexually. Get rid of her, man. You don't want any chicks that just uh, see you as a clown, as uh, some sort of entertainment to pass time. Number four. Now, stay with me on this one, guys. Let's say, hypothetically, on Monday, you get this woman's number, wherever you might be. And you're initiating conversation. She's initiating conversation. She's texting you long paragraphs, how she's attracted to you and what she likes. And she's glad that you interacted with her and approached her. She's using heart emojis, smiley face emojis. She's showing all this interest towards you, right? Let's say a couple days go past and Wednesday hits. So at the height of the conversation, you say, okay, she's interested, so I'll pull the trigger. And you say, hey, how about we get together? When are you free? Let's hang out. And she'll say, oh, okay, I'm down. I'm down for that. And you set up a time, date, and place on Wednesday. And you set it up for Saturday. Now, what will happen is she'll agree to it. But she won't text you and communicate anymore. And the reason why she stopped communicating on that Thursday, Friday, and you're like, what happened? I thought everything was going good. 
is because she never was truly interested in you in the first place. She might have showed it through text message, but as far as moving past the text conversation and meeting up in person, she doesn't want to do that. So you basically cornered her and you're like, oh, hey, let's get together and hang out. And she's like, oh, dang, I got to tell this guy that I'm not really interested in meeting him. I just want to use him for validation. So when she understands this, that you want to hang out and she agree, she feels kind of bad and she'll just stop contacting you. She'll stop initiating conversations. She'll stop, you know, texting you and all this stuff like that because she doesn't want to see you and she feels guilty. Number five, communication with women should be like volleyball and tennis. Okay. Let's say you're asking her a question. So where did you grow up? And she says, oh, I grew up over here. And she doesn't ask a question back to you. So where'd you grow up to? Or she doesn't really uh, go back and forth with you. And you're always the one that's texting her and asking her questions about herself or about her life or whatever. And she doesn't ask you anything in return. She's not interested. And you're, she's just going to like answer like, oh, I was born and raised in Massachusetts. And you'll be like, oh, cool. And you text her. So what do you like to do in your free time? And she'll say, I like to shop. I like to hang out with friends. Oh, I like to uh, go to the gym and work out. I like to watch TV. And you're like, okay. And she never asks you anything. You might ask her, so what, what type of movies do you like? You're like, oh, I like comedy, horror, and uh, science fiction. And she's never asking you anything. Remember, volleyball. And she's not hitting it back to you. Listen, you're losing. Just cut her off. She's not really interested in you. She enjoys the attention, but she doesn't want to really get to know you any further than that. Let's say you're talking and texting a woman and it's going good and you try to get physical and talk about some sexual or the bedroom. What will happen is when you try to bring these conversations up with her, she'll immediately discard of them. She'll say, oh, you know, we got to get to know each other before I go down that route. Or I like to know a guy's personality before I talk about that stuff. Or... Uh, that conversation is happening too fast. You know, it's not appropriate right now. It's too soon. <laughs> she's lying. That's not the case. Listen, if a woman is into you, she's going to talk about things physically with you over text message. Yes, before she even hangs out with you. That's why I tell you guys, get to the point with these women. Lay the groundwork so you don't meet them in person and she's kind of standoffish and closed off. The reason why women say these things that she uh, doesn't want to talk about that right now is because she views you as boyfriend material and she doesn't really see you as physically attractive like that so she'll try to act like she puts on her chastity belt and she doesn't talk about that stuff she does just not with you she doesn't really like you like that all right if you try to talk about this stuff with a woman like the kinky stuff what's her favorite position and she might try to change the subject like you'll ask her what's her favorite position in the bedroom and she'll wait a long time to text you back and she'll switch the conversation or something else is because she views you as more long-term material and she wants you to wait for sex she doesn't want to see you she wants she doesn't want you to see her as a bad uh, freaky sneaky type of girl number seven and i know this is going to sound really tempting and harmless for you guys but let me tell you how women operate and how they think if she asks you hey let's skype let's facetime let's talk on the phone let's hear each other's voices before we hang out, don't do it. Even if you've already set the date and the time and she says, hey, let's talk for a little bit. What she's doing is looking for reasons. Whether it's a tone of your voice, whether it's some political, whether you say something she doesn't like, she's looking for reasons to not want to see you. She's not truly 100% interested because women who are highly interested, they'll just come and show up. They don't need to try to test you and weed you out and call you and all. Don't do it. Okay, women do use this tactic to try to just weed out guys to find any excuse, anything to not want to hang out with you, see you and meet up. It sounds like, well, it's nothing to talk to her on the phone real quick. Don't do it because she's going to get free attention and she's going to find some reason to not want to see. you. Number eight, let's say you text a woman at 3 p.m. and she doesn't text you back for hours but you see her online. She's on WhatsApp, she's posting on Facebook, she's posting on Instagram, she's tweeting stuff on Twitter. Listen, she doesn't see you as a high priority and she's basically stringing you along and wasting your time. 
all right if you see a woman does this and she's online on different social media things or she's posting on snapchat and she can't bother to get back to you for hours and hours on end low interest you're not a priority just cut her off she's wasting your time number nine if a woman is into you guys please understand this she will move mountains she will move her schedule around she will cancel on her friends she will even call off work take vacation to see you if you ask a woman hey when are you free let's get together and hang out and she gives you a vague answer uh i'll let you know i gotta check my schedule or i'll see or maybe she's not into you if she doesn't let you know i'm free this day and this time or i'm free these days throughout the week she's not into you okay never let a woman give you a vague answer and string you along or she might say not this weekend uh maybe next weekend see how that maybe next weekend so you'll be texting her giving all this uh, validation and conversation and phone calls and facetime but what will happen is when that weekend comes Y'all ain't gonna hang out. Number 10, this is obvious. Guys, stop trying to generate a conversation and try to rebuild rapport. Look at your text thread with a woman. If you're sending these two, three sentences, eight, nine words to her, and she's replying with one word responses or maybe two words, or she might say, okay, or cool, or good, that, that's a sign of really, really low interest. Women love to talk. Women love to communicate. Always remember that. So the sign of a woman is really interested in you is that she's communicating with you uh, long sentences, heck, even a paragraph. And she's asking you different things. She's trying to get to know you. Not none of this one word stuff. Now, some women, they'll send you one word, two word text message in the beginning to, to kind of gauge your interest. Now, if it doesn't change, Throughout that, she might send it, you know, one or two word answers, the first two, three text messages. Then she'll start to get into it. That's understandable. But if the whole text conversation, you're asking her questions and, and she's sending one or two words, low interest, just cut her off. Tip.